Hey everyone and welcome back to another Sims 4 YouTube video. Today we're going to be doing kind of a two-in-one. It's a modern view and a can you get rich quick. We did this a while back with this particular challenge and it was of stealing. If our Sims could get rich by being a kleptomaniac. Well, a kleptomaniac is a trait in The Sims, obviously, and a lot of people sometimes don't want to give their Sims a kleptomaniac tra the trait because there's not that many traits in The Sims unless you have mods to have more traits in The Sims. With this mod, forget the kleptomaniac trait because you can actually be a burglar in The Sims without having to have a trait. And creator's name of this mod is Need Coffee for that, and it's Be a Burglar mod. Now, there is a for rent version that uses the for rent burglar system because if we all remember when the trailer came out for for rent, your sims could break in and basically eavesdrop on their neighbors and it uses that system but there is one if you don't have for rent and um it doesn't use that system but if you don't have the for rent pack please do not download the for rent one i have for rent so we're going to be playing with the for rent version but anyways let's get into the game and see if my sim can get rich by being a burglar so we're in game as you can see and you want to get that burglary skill and that skill is going to be through the reward store now i did kind of cheat my way into getting the points for it you need about a thousand points to unlock the burglar trait because it is through the reward store and it's not going to be through cast now with the burglar trait you can basically steal from anywhere you know you can steal from houses apartments private dwellings you can steal from but i, I do want to point out that there is cops within this mod if your sims get caught the lower the skill is, they have a higher chance of getting caught in, you know, these break-ins. So it's very important that your sims go undetected because they can get arrested. The trait is right here and here. So, and so after that, you should get this little burglary skill for your sims. So it'll basically say you can break into other people's homes and steal their valuable rights from under their noses. Increase the skill by breaking into other sims homes for a higher success chance. And eventually you will be able to break into celebrity homes and private dwellings. So the world is literally your oyster on here when it comes to stealing. And what are you doing in my house? I think that's honestly a glitch within the sims because if I'm in the city, they will just walk through my house and then go back onto the road so they need to fix that anyways i think the first place that we should start off is maybe can i break into the fangs household they've got stuff did she get caught no okay it just my screen moved and i got a bit scared i just got a little nervous okay so we acquired the skill it says this was a bus the door still closed and you sure made it a lot of noise clumsily poking around in the lock like this are you sure you want to try again let's try again what's the worst that could happen so we didn't make it in the first attempt hopefully we can make it in with this attempt we are in though. Success. Okay, so now we can go around stealing things. So keep in mind, we are still level one. So there's gonna be things that we can't really swipe, but we can swipe this like politician stand. So the more you level up, like the kleptomaniac trait, you have to basically work your way up to stealing bigger items. So like if I go to the computer, I can't really attempt to swipe it because, you know, we're not high on the, the list for that. I've been clicking different objects to see what we can and can't steal. But I will say that you don't really need the mischief skill really. And there's no like cooldown period. So if like the kleptomaniac trait, we all know how how, you know, if you steal one item, you have to wait like three hours to steal the next. With this one, I don't think it's like that. I think you just take as much as you can during your time frame that you're allowed to be in the, the house, if that makes sense. This is kind of a bust. We only got one thing. I don't really think that was successful. So I'm just gonna go back home and maybe we can hit up something else because again, literally we're only level one. Oh, we got arrested. Um, well, this kind of changes things. River was arrested. So now she's in jail. So I guess we can just look at her beautiful apartment. You do lose everything that you've stolen. I probably should have taken the sign when it said too loud to maybe leave and go to somewhere else. I don't really know what to do now. We just have to wait. Okay, so we um were, were confiscated like $16,000. The police searched River's belongings and confiscated every single stolen item and otherwise illegal item they could find on her. Was she quick enough to hide some parts of their haul? River has also been charged with a hefty fine and had to serve some jail time. Yeah. 
Uh, this is off to a great start. An absolutely great start. I don't really know what else to say other than I'm a little disappointed. I think she's gonna sleep it off. We'll sleep it off. We'll get back out there tomorrow. All right, it's now day two of if we can steal. So I'm not really sure where to go other than I'm not going back to the fangs because they literally had nothing. I also don't think we leveled up at all in that. I don't know if I should stick to the city. I have an idea. I'm in Oasis Springs. I was gonna rob the land grabs because of the amount of things that they've taken from us, but they're all home. And I don't think that'd be a smart thing. But I'm wondering, can we break into a unattended house? Cause that might be, I don't, I might be big brain for this, but if no one's home and it's unattended, there's still stuff in that house. So can I break into it? No, we cannot. What about the land crafts? I wanna travel here, break in. I think that's using the for rent stuff. I just wanna visit the residency. All right, well, we are here at the land grabs and I think I'm going to start a break in. All right, I'm a little nervous, but I think we can do it this time. Break in. All right, River, do your thing. So what did it say? That was a bus, the door's still closed and you sure made a lot of noise. Okay, we made noise. I don't think this is smart. I say we go somewhere else. Okay, I'm at the Laurent's household because number one, this is like one of my favorite houses in The Sims. Number two, they've got some stuff. All right, <laughs> I'm a little nervous. Hopefully she doesn't make that much noise. She's really going in with the crowbar. Honestly, at this point, I just don't think she's cut out for this lifestyle. The, you know what, let's just continue. Let's continue with this. Just, it was still loud, but she did it. Okay, let's do this. What can we steal? Okay, I think I'm gonna have her swipe this little globe right here, whatever it is. Cause so far that's the only thing that I've found that she could swipe and uh, she did that. I don't know if anyone's seen her. I don't think they did. It's just, I can't really swipe anything cause she's so low on her skill. I don't know where, she's only level one and we've got like 53% complete. So that's why she can't swipe anything. Oh wait, we can swipe this. I don't know what this is, but she's gonna swipe it. So we've got two things here. I think we should probably check upstairs. And then after we go upstairs, I think we should call it a night. I don't want to get, if I get arrested again, I'm ending the video. If I get arrested, I'm going to lose it because how? There is no one here to see me unless they've got an alarm system, but I don't think they do. Okay. Can we, can, can we swipe the carpet? Bro, this is, I'm swiping everything in this household. Wait, if we can swipe the carpet, like the rugs, I didn't know we could do that. Okay, well, our time's almost up. I'm just gonna have her come outside. I think we did, I think we did good. We, we stole a lot for our first, oh Lord. Did she get caught? <gasps> she got caught. Oh, heck to the nose. Oh my gosh. Oh no, no, this is not how it was supposed to go. We were so close. She just needs to, you need to run out. You need to go. Just go. Did she win? <gasps> she won the fight. That's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm talking about. No, I'm done. I'm done. I am so done. I I don't even have words. We have to spend another night in jail. We probably got fined again. At this point, I'm convinced the game hates me. Bess, I can't afford anything right now. I'm about to lose my entire funds. And what? at what cost? What are we even at in our level? Did we level up at all? We're about to. We lost $22,000. We had to pay, just go to sleep. I don't even wanna see you. I don't wanna speak to you, River. You had one job and you failed. All right, it's day three. We're gonna go out, try and have a successful day. I mean, I don't really know what else to say other than those last two attempts were crap. We didn't do what we were supposed to do. And honestly, I don't even really wanna go back out. I just don't know where to go. Like. Who should I steal from? I feel like now I'm kind of scared to go out. All right, we're at this house in San Sequoia and I think I'm gonna try and break into this one because I don't think anyone's here. I don't wanna get caught again. If I get caught for the third time, this video is definitely ending. Great mod though, great mod. I'm hoping that she does love, okay, so we leveled up. The door's still closed, but we can always try again. She's level two now. So I'm hoping that she's learned from her past mistakes and we busted in to the door. Let me swipe this bike really quickly. Let me swipe this other bike to, because we're level two, I'm wondering if we can swipe some extra objects. 
Come on, make this quick. I don't wanna be caught again. Okay, I stole that backpack on the table there. And then I think what I'm gonna do, I'll take the friendship bracelet kit. I don't care. I'll take that too. At this point, I just want everything. Is there anything outside that I can swipe? Oh, we can take the grill. I think after the grill, I'm going home. I'm ending this and I'm going home. There's no way I could get caught. Oh, thank God. We did it. Third Lux to Charm, guys. All right, so we're gonna have her come back inside. She's now level two, though, which is good. She swiped a lot of objects. I honestly, let me put this down to about a thousand like I do for most of my can you get rich quick things because or no I didn't mean to take a thousand I wanted to set it to a thousand because I want to track how much money we're making but she also needs some money so we got these skis I'm gonna sell that sell these bikes we got the grill which was about a thousand dollars friendship bracelet kit the gnome that I stole backpack and the basic keepsake box. So we basically got 22, 2,290 simoleons from that. I don't know, where is my sim? Okay, so I would say that was a success. What are we on now level wise for the burglary? We are level two, almost level three again. There's only five levels to this. So I say it's 1143 in the morning. I kind of am on a burglary high right now. Let's go and see if we can steal from some other sims. Here we go. Jer and let's start a break in break and I honestly could probably play with this mod all day did she just walk in the door and then break in from inside darling you're already inside okay well that was a lot easier so she didn't make a lot of noise we busted it on the first try which is very very good i'm very proud of my sim okay yeah honestly i think our only luck is gonna be that grill so i'm gonna s cancel this event go back home we got the grill though because the grills are pretty expensive in the sims so i think we did make some pretty good money on that one today we literally have done two robberies in one day yeah 1300 bucks that's fine i will take that okay so i think what we'll do now is what level is she's on because i might do another one i might try and we're 83 percent let's go to the land grabs uh they've taken so much from us over the years i think it's time we take from them okay we got in and we're almost to level three which is good Ooh, no one's here at the land grabs get that grill that is 1300 bucks right there okay and we leveled up to level three we can swipe the tvs now now we're talking can we swipe the computers since we can swipe the tvs yes we can okay so level three in the burglary like levels is where you can really probably start to make your money because you can get the computers is there anything upstairs that we can take we can take the easels i think the hack to this is before you um before you go home just to end that because then you're not having to fight against the people that are back home if that makes sense that's a massive rug i don't think we'll be able to take that it seemed like we could take like the carpets oh here we go okay i think i'm gonna end on these two things being swiped we did not get caught we are now level three again and we took a lot of stuff from that one holy crap i'm gonna have to sit her down like we're going through all of our stuff that we stole so basically we got about well okay so the computers and stuff are probably gonna be in our household inventory so this is 1300 bucks these two rugs combined are 470 I think each if we go into build mode and go into our household here's where all the other stuff 3500 bucks these two computers 10 grand 20 grand we made 20 grand from those computers the easels 350 that's fine and then 8000 for these holy crap that's a lot of money that we just made if we take from what we've made in the last like three robberies today that were successful that is about 37,210 simoleons that we made because remember we had about a thousand dollars or maybe it was a little we had about a thousand dollars that we put into the account so it's yeah 30 37,210 10 simoleons i'm pretty sure is what we made guys i'm having a lot of fun with this mod i highly recommend downloading it this is a lot better than the kleptomaniac skill there's so much potential that you can do with this mod i say tomorrow we hit up those celebrity homes all right so it is now day four she's been on the computer for a little bit i didn't want to leave so early in the morning because i feel like 
there would be more Sims at their house in the morning. But I think we can go ahead and begin our day of stealing. All right, we are here at the Bailey Moon household. Oh, wait a minute. Maybe we don't have enough skills yet to break into a celebrity's home because we don't have here. Okay, so... um scratch that maybe if we steal from one more place we'll be able to get there i think i might cheat this just to see what it would be like stealing from a celebrity home so we're on level four now okay i'm wondering if this allows us to break in still no what about if we do a level five let's see what life would be like if we are at a level five okay now we can do high security celebrity homes if you're on level five which is fine because honestly we kind of got the of what this mod is like from stealing with other homes. If you're on level five, Judith, what are you doing here? You're next, you're next. Don't be surprised if you see me in the next few hours at your house. Okay, so we are breaking it. She's at level five, by the way. So it should be a very easy for her to get in and get out without making too much noise. All right, that was a bust. It's still closed. Never mind, I jinxed it. Can we do it again? I learned from last time that I probably shouldn't do that, but it was, we did get a success from that. Looks like no one's home. We can, again, we can steal the computers. So I'm trying to find, there's a TV down here. Can we swipe that? Yes, this has gotta be expensive guys. Can we steal artwork? Oh, okay, we've hit a mine. We've hit a gold mine now if we can steal artwork. Cause before I couldn't steal artwork and it was kind of annoying because the artwork pieces are incredibly expect expensive depending on what it is. Okay, yeah, let's swipe these two. Literally gonna come back to an empty house. House. We're almost out of this time thing right here. And I would like for her to be done before she uh, has like the people come back. Okay, why are you doing push-ups, right? She has just been swiping all these photos. Okay, I'm gonna end this really quick because there were people that were coming by. Sorry if that was a bit short. I just got scared. My, my heart dropped for a minute. We did not get caught, which is a good thing. I'm gonna have her come back inside. I think all the things that I stole are in our household inventory. Yeah, here they are. So the TV, again, 10 grand. I'm not surprised by that. That TV is expensive. This one's 415. These three photos are about seven. 165 simoleons and then we have five things of artwork that come out to 2,075 simoleons so now we're up to $51,000 in our accounts and so now I think we go to Judith's house and see what we can get from there all right we're at the ward den kind of the it house of del sol valley we're gonna start a break and I don't know if Judith is here or not but if I were Judith I would probably be at work because she is an actress probably the actress dress will break into this house. We know the drill by now. All right, so here she goes. I'm worried that it's gonna say the door's locked. Oh, okay, we got it. And she's focused now. All right, that's good. So she's feeling very focused right now. Oh, we can swipe these. I'm taking everything. I am taking everything from Judith. We can get this. I know this photo right here is expensive. Judith has got a lot of interesting artwork and just an interesting house to say the least. Like there, there's never a dull moment in here. Oh, we can swipe the flowers, take those flowers, take those flowers. Do you got any artwork, Judith, in your room? Oh, you do. And you've got some in there. <laughs> I'm having a blast. Okay, we're gonna go upstairs now because the time's almost kind of out. It does go quicker than you think. We've got this photo, we've got this right here. See, it's, all right. I keep on forgetting that you can't really steal the mirrors on here. She's gotta have more artwork. Oh, here we go. Those things, these are where it's at right here. I do think you can break into these vaults, although you do have to be like a certain level of the burglary career, um, but this is already open. I don't think anything's in it. Yeah, it says simoleons and vault is zero, but if there was money in there, you can steal that. Okay, we're kind of coming close to an end. I kind of need to wrap it up with what I'm doing and I think we'll just call that a day. I think we got a lot of money from that. I don't even wanna say I think, I, I know we got a lot of money from that. So as far as I'm concerned, the only things that are in our inventory is this violin and then the easel, which is just 350 and then these two flowers, which come out to 450. Then if I go back into build mode, here is where everything else is. I'm honestly a little nervous to see how much we made in a good way. This is 21 simoleons. We got two, so it comes out to 4,390 simoleons. Two of these 
Sotheby's artwork. This is 7,500, so it comes out to uh, even 15 grand. Then we have this photo right here. These three night like armor things, which come out to 24,600. These two paintings right here, which should come out to 2,910, so almost three grand. And then these two paintings over here that we took, we are at 6,740 simoleons. And then these dogs over here, I'm pretty sure they're dogs, which comes out to 1,300. 50 and at the end of all of that we are at 108,049 simoleons that we basically stole. I will say if you take 1,000 off of that we gained 107,049 simoleons in a span of four days. With all that said and done I will say that it is completely possible for your sims to get rich quick using this mod in the sims. A while back I did the kleptomaniac one. We didn't make as much money as I made in this one I will say I actually had a blast while playing with this mod it was my first time playing with it and I heavily recommend putting it into your game because this adds for more storyline with your sims you know depending on what storyline or challenges you're doing you can easily make a family of just burglars you can also take your family members on your break-ins with you nothing will really happen they'll just be there with you as well they won't cause any commotions from what I've read so you can make this a family family business, you know, easily in The Sims. Thank you all so much for watching today's video. Hope you enjoyed today's Can You Get Rich X Mod Edition. Let me know down in the comments if you would download this mod and have you played with this mod and what were your thoughts on this mod if you have. With that being said, I do want to say thank you so much because I'm pretty sure we're at 729 subscribers. As you all know, I'm trying to get to a thousand subscribers before my one year anniversary, which is almost a month away. And I would love to get to that thousand subscriber mark. And with your help, we can do so. So why don't you hit that subscribe button to join on all the fun we're having on this channel. But with that, I will see you all on Monday.